next a new chapter introduction to graphs okay here have you seen the graph in the newspaper television magazine what is the purpose of the graph the purpose of the graph is to show numerical facts in visual form so that they can be understood quickly clearly and easily okay so already learned how to draw histogram bar graph then double bar graph pie chart etc in this chapter we are going to learn about the line graph okay what is a line graph line graph mean data that changes continuously over periods of time okay for example here the following graph shows the temperature of a patient in a hospital recorded every hour continuous period okay every hour then temperature already marked on y axis time already marked on x axis okay here some question already given in your textbook what was the patient's temperature at 1 pm this is 1 pm should this uh, point represent what temperature at 1 pm that means what 36.5 okay this what 36.5 degree celsius okay 36.5 degree celsius okay next one when was the parents temperature 38.5 degree celsius this is 38.5 degree celsius you should draw it okay this point represent what 12 noon okay 12 noon for 38.5 degree celsius at 12 noon next the patient's temperature was the same two times during the period given what were these two times same temperature uh, two uh, two times showing the same temperature here 1 pm and 2 pm showing what is it 36.5 degree celsius okay what was the temperature at 130 pm in 130 pm represent what 1 pm between 1 pm and 2 pm this point represent what 130 pm 130 pm should draw it this also y axis here this perpendicular line meet at this point these two perpendicular line meet at this point this point represent what 36.5 degree celsius then 130 pm the temperature will be what 36.5 degree celsius how did you arrive at your answer you just to draw that uh, perpendicular to x axis and y axis you will get what 130 pm and 36.5 degree celsius during which periods did the patient's temperature showed an upward trend upward trend means what here 9 to 10 9 am to 10 am the temperature increases okay that means first in time 9 am to 10 am the temperature increases next time 10 am to 11 am also the temperature increases next day 2 to 3 2 pm to 3 pm also temperature increases okay the temperature showed upward trend okay next year third question for an experiment in botany two different plants plant a and plant b were grown under similar laboratory conditions the heights were measured at the end of each week for 3 weeks this results are shown by the following graph here first this graph first origin here the plant growing from here the starting point is there okay after 7 days 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 one week over okay one week over plant b 1 cm plant a 2 cm after one week the 7 days over that means second week in second week the plant a and plant b reach what's a 7 cm next after third week plant a 8 sorry 9 cm and plant b 10 cm okay how high was plant a after two weeks after two weeks plant a 7 cm okay you can write the answer 7 cm third week 
plant A, plant A means this dotted line, dotted line plant A, this line showing what is it? 9 centimeter. Okay, this is showing 9 9 centimeter. Next one, how high was plant B after 2 weeks? Plant B, plant B means what is straight line, okay. Plant B get to what is it? 2 weeks, 2 weeks means 7 centimeter. Here also the same thing 7 centimeter. Third week, in third week plant B 10 centimeter. How much did plant A grow during the third week? In during the third week, plant A here, plant A in second week 7 centimeter and plant, uh, third week 9 centimeter. What is the difference bet between 7 centimeter and 9 centimeter? 9 centimeter minus 7 centimeter equal to what? 2 centimeter. In during the third week, okay, it grows 2 centimeter. Okay. The remaining questions homework, GEF or ho also homework. Next one, use the tables below to draw line graph. The number of days a hillside city received snow in different years. Here, years and days already given there 2003, 2004, 2005, 2006 days 8, 10, 5, 12. Okay. Here first we have to draw x axis and y axis. On x axis you should mark here and y axis you should mark days ok first one but here first you start from 0 should draw the zigzag line zigzag line you should draw it this showing what from origin the 2003 first you start from here 2003 2003, so many years in between 2003 and 0. Next you should 2 units you leave it 2004, again 2 units leave it 2005, 2 units 2006, ok. This is years, x axis. Next y axis, this is a y axis, days, first one, two, four, Eight, ten, twelve. Here, first one two thousand three eight, two thousand three eight, two thousand four ten, two thousand five five. In between 4 and 6, one line is there, this represent this point represent 5, 2006, 12, 2006, 12, 12. join these two uh, 4 points, You will get line graph.
should write it the scale scale on x axis 1 unit 1 unit equal to 1 year scale on y axis 1 unit equal to 2 days this represent 2 days ok 2, two days ok then scale on x axis 1 unit equal to 1 year should write it scale x axis and y axis scale you should write it there then this is a line graph ok homework exercise 15.1 question number 2 4, 5, 6 and 7.